you're about to go into the heart of Africa, to a wild corner of the Kruger National Park, Singita Lobombo, on a real life, real time African safari. Watch as the daily dramas unfold. From the smallest detail to the giants of the bush. Through the eyes of our cameramen, rangers and animal experts. Uncut, unplanned, unexpected. Join John Varty, big cat specialist and master guide. African explorer Andy Kutsia. And myself, Michaela Strachan. This is the real wild world. Caught on Safari Live. Tonight we're talking about animal intelligence. JV is on his evening safari and he's with an animal that's considered to be highly intelligent. JV, are you with us? Welcome everybody. This is National Geographic Safari Live. We are in Singita, Kruger National Park, South Africa. And what a start we've had to our game drive. We've picked up a beautiful herd of elephants. Just moving slowly through this area, which was burnt just a few days ago. It is a breeding herd. We have some huge cows, some young calves and they are very peaceful and very relaxed. It's an interesting uh, structure in this herd. These will be cows with various offspring. This little calf right here in front of us is the calf of this mother that's moving right towards our vehicle now. Now she may have some other calves that are older than this calf still traveling with her. Okay everybody I'd like you just to talk softly, stay very still. Now this might seem dangerous, it's not dangerous at all. What we do in situations like this is you just watch the body language of the elephant. She came through, she picked her spot, she stood tall, never flapped her ears, never trumpeted, didn't show any sign of aggression. Here come two more sub-adults. Now this is the advantage you have when you're in a concession area like this. The guides are highly trained and people in complete safety but in open vehicles can view these magnificent animals at close quarters.
What an experience. Literally 15 feet from our vehicle. The largest land mammal in the world and perfectly relaxed. The whole herd just moving past. Now you can see the elephant flapping its ears. It's quite a hot day, it's very humid. And inside those ears is a network of veins. And what the elephant's doing is exposing the veins to the air. So if we're hot, the elephant's hot. And the way it cools itself is to fan the body with those big ears. Truly exhilarating to be so close, but so relaxed as these elephants came past.